Hi, it's me, Chabala. I'm not gonna talk and like sit down and talk about my TBR because I'm not around to do that. I'm kind of busy with life, so I'm gonna just say it right here. All right. So, first one is read a book with a cover that matches your birthstone. I don't have that, so I'm gonna read The Alchemist, and I'm really excited for this. It's been on my TBR for a while. Next question is read a book that starts with the word the, not question, challenge, and that's gonna be The Alchemist again because why not? I mean, it fits, right? Like, it's there already, so why not? Yeah. <laughs> Next is read a book that inspired a movie you've already seen. See, I don't have any, uh, but I have a TV show. It's a reality TV show by one of my favorite people who is Bonang Mateba, who's a wonderful TV presenter, um, South African starlight, and I'm so excited to read this book. I love her very, very, very much. Mm. Next is read the first book you touch and hear. Oh, and also read a book that takes place in a different continent. So I picked The Seven Husbands of Evelyn Hugo. Oh, look at that shot. Yeah, I want to read this badly. Next is read a book that, like, read a book completely outside your house. <laughs> Dang, this is bad. Uh, I picked Spinning Silver. I've had this on my TBR for a while and I've actually read quite a bit of it, but I never finished it. So I thought this would be a perfect opportunity to finally finish it, like during the reading rush. Next is read a book in a genre that you've always wanted to read more of. And that has to be African lit. I've been pushing for it this year. So I picked none other than Coconut, uh, written by Kopano. I am so excited to read this book. It's so beautiful. The cover is gorgeous. And like, you know, why not? And I'm willing to work hard and read more of this genre. That's my Reading Rush TBR for 2020. This is my first time participating. I'm really excited. Uh, if you want to learn more about the Reading Rush, please check down below. Uh, otherwise, thank you so much for watching and goodbye.